Hello everyone, welcome to the Spiritual Hub. It's your girl coming to you live with a message of what you need to know today. So you guys, definitely seeing a lot of manifestations happen. Now this card did flip upside down, which means leads me to believe that you feel as though maybe those manifestations aren't coming quick enough for you. But that is not the case. I repeat, that is not the case. Because what is actual is, you know, you're manifesting people coming in and you're manifesting being open and also going out there and making changes happen. Okay, and because you have such a high vibrational energy frequency with that, it's like you're really successing. Okay, you're really successing. Um, and, and, and mainly this is emotionally, you know, because you balancing out your emotions, I feel has everything to do with it. Yes, baby. Okay. <laughs> um, you know, and then you've got the two twos. Yeah, the two twos. And it's like, you know, your relationship that you're in is very balanced and it's helping you to move forward, helping them to move forward. There's such a duality of wanting each other to thrive and wanting each other to succeed. Um, and, and, and it's an amazing vibration from what I can understand. Even though you're going through, you know, what seems to be like emotional situations outside of your relationship, you know, you're solid, you're solid, and you're standing on solid ground both ways while also balancing your finances. Yeah, and both of y'all are in that energy as well, so it's just very interesting. You know what I mean? Yeah, because, you know, with the world card, it's like, okay, you're talking to the universe, the universe is talking back to you, you're aligned with the universe, so everything is positive. You know, and then you're also starting to see balance, like your relationships in your life have substance. Your relationships in your life are longevity. You know, your relationships in your life have vitality and will continue to be good connections throughout the times. You know, um, and that's a beautiful frequency to even understand and align to. You know what I mean? Because, you know, yeah, sometimes you're going to feel like, okay, this person's poking at me or, 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 you know, trying to make me feel some type of way. And it's like nobody can ever make you feel any type of way in the first place. And let me explain. No, let me explain. Because whenever, you know, somebody, whenever, it, whenever a situation happens, understand one thing. You are the only thing in this world, the only person in this world who can actually heal you on all levels. That is self-healing. Nobody can make you self-heal. They can help you to the highest degree. They can even put a little health of theirs onto you so you could feel their vibration a little better. But nobody can really heal you except you. You have to put in the work, okay? So whenever somebody comes up pointing the finger at you and you feel like, oh, you know, oh, you're being some type of way, you're judging me. People are going to be judgy, okay? A little bit judgy. Why? You're judgy. I'm judgy. We're all a little bit judgy and you need to be judgy so that you can move forward in life and trust that intuition because that is your judge. That's your higher judge that lets you know, like, okay, this is what you do do. This is what you don't do. And that's how you stay aligned. Right, while having this temperance with yourself, having patience with yourself, having patience with other people, so that whenever you, you know, step out there into the world, you're received and 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 can receive others in, in such a reciprocity that builds both, you know, in all facets, and that's beautiful. That's really beautiful. Okay, yeah. Yeah, and you're going for a new beginning. What's the new beginning? No, you're probably not going to change your, you know, name tomorrow and move to Mars. You know, I'm not talking about that kind of change. I'm talking about you're actually getting a new opportunity. You are getting a fresh mind. You are getting a fresh start, a fresh heart, and you are moving forward with such a positivity. You are moving forward with such uh, uh, excitedness for what's to come. 
you know, and, and so many things like that. You're just moving forward in a great way. And I know that because the chariot card is what we're talking about now. The chariot card with that one, okay, but the chariot card by itself just is saying that you're going for the things that, you're bringing the things together that you can control to come together for the greater good, but for your vision. You know, and there's nothing wrong with that as long as it harms nobody, which it never really ever will if it gets to that higher up of a degree. Um, and that's a good thing to know. That's even an epiphany. So even if you're, you're, even if you've been in a like really toxic, like really, really toxic environment sometime, um, <clears throat> that kind of stuff evens out because even though you think that it may be so toxic, this, this, and that, and it could be very well, um, it's also not going to be ridiculous. It's also going to be, you know, um, a situation of if you love yourself, you'll leave. If you love yourself, you'll do right by the other person, you know, and you'll move forward in that kind of an energy. And I feel like that's what you do. That is what you do. And people may feel like you're a little sneaky because you, you know, you accept people. And it's like, you're not sneaky because you accept people. You're really forgiving and really caring um while also being not caring you know you have a reciprocity and a balance with your emotions and that's what's up um you know because you ain't out here fighting with everybody you ain't out here fighting with yourself because you're like no i'm gonna put an end to that negative energy and once you get yourself together and you get your energy right then you can holler at me okay then you can call me then we can vibe we can have a chill sesh like you know we can do all kinds of anything but you gonna correct your energy before you step this way you hear me okay um, and that's really what's going on. Because with the judgment card right here, you've made a decision to not even care if somebody's being sneaky. You've made a decision to not even care if somebody thinks that they're getting one on or one over. You decided to have the kind of energy that is just like, I'm going to do right by you. And if you do wrong by me, you can deal with that karma yourself. And it's a certain kind of reciprocity because you know you're not trying to, you know, uh, persuade that person because you know you're not 100% right. So you're not going to try to change that person's free will or none of that. You're just going to, you know, let their energy be their energy. You know, while also adding a flair of your own energy intertwining and, and integrating. And that's a beautiful thing because why? Because that allows you and the person, but mainly the situation, to heal. Yeah, it heals to a degree where they can come in with an apology. They can come in and ask for another, you know, situation. Or you can end that situation and a whole new situation is already on the way. And that's a certain type of reciprocity that we must all understand about this energy reading. Okay, so even if you're closing doors, just understand that there's doors opening right now. Um, and you don't have to feel any kind of way about it because things are really working out for the higher, greatest good. There's a Lion Gates portal that's happening tomorrow, 8, 8 Um, And it is going to be a major manifestation portal in which I will be posting about later on today. Um, but yeah, you guys, I just had to come out and give a message. You know, Spirit was calling me, telling me, go get out there. You got things to do. <laughs> So you know me, okay? Stay working, stay doing something. Um, that just had to give this message. I know y'all see my chest all out and stuff, and y'all probably like, girl, and I didn't have three kids, okay? Don't judge. Um, looking good, okay? So, but this is the morning, you know, before I even did my face, before I even washed my face, y'all. I didn't even wash my face yet. It's yesterday's makeup. Um, you know, um, I haven't even took my shower this morning, brushed my teeth, none of that. I just had, I was like, yo, the Spirit's telling me to get on this live and holler at my people. Um, and thank God for the reciprocity that you guys provide. Much love to you guys. Much blessings to you guys. So excited for the new things and new opportunities that we have coming up. Um, do stay tuned this weekend, you guys. So, so much things are coming in. I'm going to help you guys manifest that wealth. I'm going to help you guys manifest that, you know, that getting those actual goals getting goals quicker okay i'm going to help you to manifest that um and we're going to do a lot of really deep intimate um energy tuning you guys so god bless you stay blessed and never stressed much peace much power
and much love.